This will be a short video, but we're going to show you just how to test out your tower and how to present it to the company who wants to move to Sticksville. Remember, our goal is to make our tower as tall but as skinny as possible so we can get as big of a slenderness ratio as we can. Then we want to try to get it to hold the weight of a golf ball, which simulates the people going in and out of the office. To actually make those measurements and get those distances, we'll use this tape measure. Go ahead and drop the tape measure down to the very bottom and measure to the spot where you place the golf ball. In this case, it was about 30 inches. Then we'll do the exact same thing for the width of the tower. Hopefully it'll be much smaller. And in this case, we got four and a half inches. What we then want to do is take those two numbers and divide the height by the width to get that ultimate slenderness ratio. We ended up between six and seven, which isn't bad at all. And if you want to continue to challenge yourself, try placing more weight on top, like in this case, a baseball. Remember that bonus challenge that we introduced? Another fun way to test out your tower is to blow on it as hard as you can and see if it can withstand that wind, sort of like this. You'd be surprised at how much force your breath can generate. So we hope you're excited to get started designing and building, friends. And please don't be discouraged if your tower tips over or breaks while you're loading it down or trying to blow it over. Just make some adjustments. You should have plenty of materials. We can't wait to see what you come up with, and we hope you have a ton of fun in the process.